Hey everyone, welcome to my video. Today in this video we will model this strange shape together. Uh, let's open a new part. The top plane, I create a sketch. Let's use an arc. Something like this. And then I combine this two point with the line. This is 100. Undefined, so we click line, control is pressed, and origin selected, midpoint. Top plane is selected, we go plane, select this line, and create 4 to 5 degree angle. We have a new sketch as well. We will make here now. Uh, 60. Sorry, by the way, this should be radius 50. Second sketch. I'm gonna convert this guy and convert it to construction geometry as well. It's good. Sketch first is done. We open top plane going to use now a circle and to convert this construction geometry remove half okay the other one third sketch a uh, fourth sketch another guy here and we trim Make this construction geometry. Okay, we can go aloft. One, two, and then one, two. So it is looking nice with surface. We need everything. Plane could be hidden. Top plane. Sketch and here one eighty millimeter circle and then convert it to construction geometry. Here we create a ten circle and then we will copy it. Circle selected, circular pattern, then instances sixteen. They are blue, so we need to attach them to our points. We can make all of these guys, half of it, uh, construction geometry. And then here, we are going to make some offset. Value 0 0.5, base geometry will be converted to a, a construction geometry. Then now one, we are gradually increasing value. Now one and a half, and now two. Okay. Align to make it mirror, mirror entities. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We copied them to the other side, mirror them, split line, then we project them simply what we have done. Select this one, go to split, go project them. Sorry for my very fast using of SolidWorks. Each day, eight, ten hours, I'm busy modeling things. Sometimes I'm not even aware of how fast I am modeling. So we created this nice shape. It is a surface body consists of one sheet. And then we created here with two millimeter offset. That can be taken. And then we come to fill it, create a radius of one 
select surfaces this guy this guy and the other side partial view will help you a lot then you don't need to wait a lot so after we select and operation is done sometimes guys telling me how to improve their uh, modeling skills in the SOLIDWORKS so this is one of the way just randomly modeling things trying to achieve some strange shapes and trying to experience this is the key guys if you do that you will reach a point that you would like to have so thanks for watching if you like my video hit the like button make a comment See you in another video.